planning a trip to Paris? Want to know the top tourist attractions? Well, you're in the right place. In this video, we'll take you on a virtual tour of the top 10 must-see places in the City of Light. From the cobblestone streets of Montmartre to the iconic Eiffel Tower, we've got you covered. We'll start from number 10 and work our way up to the number one spot. For each location, we'll not only tell you what makes it special but also suggest some fun activities you can do there. Whether you're an art lover, a history buff, or just someone looking for an unforgettable experience, there's something in Paris for everyone. We'll also share some insider tips and tricks to help you make the most of your visit. So whether you're planning your first visit or your 10th, there's always something new to discover. So buckle up and get ready to explore the city of love. Starting our countdown at number 10, we have Montmartre. Montmartre is a large hill in Paris's 18th arrondissement, often bustling with life and filled with artistic history. It's a place where famous artists like Pablo Picasso and Vincent van Gogh once found their inspiration. The crown jewel of Montmartre is undoubtedly the Sacré-Cœur Basilica. Its stunning architecture and the panoramic view of Paris from its highest point are truly sights to behold. But don't let the grandeur of Sacré-Cœur distract you from Montmartre's other charms. This district is steeped in a bohemian ambiance that's quite unlike anywhere else. As you stroll around the winding streets, you'll find quaint shops, local cafes, and vibrant street art. Don't hesitate to pop into a cafe for a cup of coffee or try a fresh croissant from a local bakery. Montmartre is all about the experience. A visit to Montmartre is like stepping into a Parisian postcard. Next up at number 9 we have the Champs-Élysées. This iconic avenue stretching from the Place de la Concorde to the Arc de Triomphe is a bustling hotspot for locals and visitors alike. Known for its theaters, cafes, and luxury shops, the Champs-Élysées is often referred to as the world's most beautiful avenue. As you amble down this grand thoroughfare, you'll find a myriad of shopping opportunities, from high-end luxury brands to quaint boutiques. Don't forget to stop at the La Durée Bakery for a taste of their world-renowned macarons. After a day of shopping, why not relax in one of the many cafes lining the avenue? Sip on a cup of rich French coffee as you watch the world go by. And of course, the crowning glory of the Champs-Élysées, the Arc de Triomphe, awaits at the avenue's western end. This monument, steeped in history, offers panoramic views of the city from its rooftop. No trip to Paris is complete without a stroll down the Champs-Élysées. At number 8, we have none other than the Louvre. This iconic Parisian landmark is not just a museum, but a testament to centuries of art and culture. Born as a fortress in the late 12th century, it morphed into a royal palace before finally becoming one of the world's largest and most visited museums. With its sprawling labyrinth of corridors, the Louvre houses an astonishing array of art collections, spanning from antiquity to the mid-19th century. The Mona Lisa, the Venus de Milo, the winged victory of Samothrace, these are just a few of the masterpieces that call the Louvre home. But remember, this gem offers more than just art. Its architecture with the striking glass pyramid is a sight to behold. We recommend spending a day exploring the museum, embracing the history and soaking up the art. The Louvre is a feast for art lovers. Coming in at number 7 is the Seine River Cruise. Imagine gliding gracefully along the serene waters of the Seine, with the city of love unfolding before your eyes. This is no ordinary boat ride. It's a journey through the heart of Paris, where each bend in the river reveals a new spectacle. From the deck you'll see iconic landmarks such as the Eiffel Tower, Louvre Museum, and Notre Dame Cathedral. Each one, a testament to the city's rich history and architectural prowess. As you sail under the many ornate bridges you'll feel a connection to the countless artists, poets and lovers who have been inspired by these views for centuries. But here's a tip. Take the cruise at sunset. As the sun dips below the horizon casting a golden hue over the city, the sights from the Seine become even more breathtaking. Truly, a Seine River cruise is a must-do for the romantics. Halfway through our list at number 6 is the Palace of Versailles. This opulent chateau is a symbol of the absolute monarchy of the ancient regime. Its origins date back to the 17th century under the reign of Louis XIV. Over time it evolved from a hunting lodge into a palace housing the central power of the kingdom. The palace is renowned for its grand architecture, particularly the Hall of Mirrors. This iconic gallery boasting 357 mirrors is a marvel of Baroque artistry. The palace is also home to beautifully manicured gardens, where one can lose oneself in its maze-like design. Visiting the Palace of Versailles is like stepping back in time. To truly appreciate its splendor and historical significance, 
we recommend taking a guided tour. It's an experience that transcends the physical, immersing you in the history and culture of France's golden age. The Palace of Versailles is a testament to the grandeur of French monarchy. At number 5, we have the Notre Dame Cathedral. Ah, Notre Dame, an architectural marvel that has stood the test of time. Nestled in the heart of Paris, the cathedral's Gothic design is nothing short of awe-inspiring. The intricate sculptures, the stunning stained-glass windows and the towering spires all work together to create an atmosphere of profound serenity. Notre Dame's history is as rich as its architecture. Construction began in the 12th century and continued for nearly 200 years, a testament to the dedication and artistry of the craftsmen who built it. This cathedral has witnessed countless historical events, from the crowning of Napoleon Bonaparte to the liberation of Paris in World War II. For those who don't mind a bit of a climb, ascending to the top of Notre Dame is a must. The panoramic view of Paris from the top is breathtaking and well worth the effort. The Notre Dame Cathedral is a masterpiece of French Gothic architecture. Coming in at number 4 is the iconic Eiffel Tower. A marvel of human ingenuity, this lattice iron structure has been standing tall since 1889. It was designed by Gustav Eiffel for the World's Fair, and at that time it was the tallest man-made structure in the world. The Eiffel Tower is more than just an architectural wonder, it's a vantage point that offers a breathtaking panorama of the City of Lights. From the very top, Paris unfurls beneath you like a story waiting to be read. And while the view is a feast for the eyes, your taste buds shouldn't miss out. The tower houses Le Jules Verne, an exquisite restaurant on the second floor. Here you can bask in the ambiance, savor world-class French cuisine, and toast to the cityscape that twinkles outside your window. In the heart of Paris, amidst its hustle and bustle, the Eiffel Tower stands as a symbol of elegance and grandeur. The Eiffel Tower is the symbol of Paris. At number 3, we have the vibrant Latin Quarter. Nestled on the left bank of the Seine, this historic district is a gem that epitomizes the quintessential Parisian charm. With a history that stretches back to the Middle Ages, the Latin Quarter is the home of the Sorbonne, one of the world's oldest universities. The lively ambiance of this place is truly infectious. As you stroll through its narrow winding streets, you'll find a plethora of quaint bookshops, bustling cafes and eclectic boutiques. It's an area that nurtures creativity and intellect, a place where the past and the present coexist harmoniously. And let's not forget about the food. The Latin Quarter is a culinary paradise. From traditional French bistros to international cuisine, there's something to tantalize every taste bud. So when you're here, make sure to explore the neighborhood, and don't be shy about trying the local cuisine. The Latin Quarter is the heart of Parisian Bohemia. Just missing the top spot, at number 2, we have the Sacre Coeur Basilica. Nestled at the very pinnacle of the city, this basilica is more than a religious monument. It's a crowning achievement of architectural grandeur. Its gleaming white domes embellished with intricate mosaics stand proudly as a testament to the city's rich history and unwavering faith. The Basilica of the Sacred Heart, as it's also known, is located at the summit of Montmartre, the highest point in the city. Here you're not just visiting a basilica, you're ascending to a vantage point that offers an unmatched panoramic view of Paris. Imagine the cityscape bathed in the golden hues of a new dawn, the Eiffel Tower in the distance, slowly coming to life with the rising sun. It's an experience that's simply unparalleled, and for those early birds amongst you a sunrise visit is highly recommended. Witnessing the city awaken from the top of Sacré-Cœur is truly an ethereal experience. The sacre Coeur Basilica is a spiritual beacon in Paris. And finally at number one we have the eerie yet intriguing catacombs. What an extraordinary place this is! A labyrinthine network of tunnels, stretching across a staggering 200 miles beneath the bustling streets of Paris. The catacombs of Paris are steeped in history. Conceived in the late 18th century as a solution to the city's overflowing cemeteries, they now house the remains of an estimated 6 million Parisians, each bone meticulously arranged, creating an uncanny mosaic of mortality. In the dimly lit tunnels, time seems to stand still, each step you take brings you closer to the city's past. The air is heavy with history, the silence punctuated only by the soft echo of your own footsteps. For those seeking a deeper understanding, we highly recommend taking a guided tour. Knowledgeable guides will illuminate the tales behind the bones, transforming your visit into a chilling but fascinating journey through Paris's past. The catacombs offer a chilling but fascinating experience. 
And there you have it, the top 10 tourist attractions in Paris. From the artistic enclave of Montmartre to the iconic Champs-Élysées, each location holds its unique charm and allure. We've journeyed through the vast collections of the Louvre, sailed along the serene Seine River, and marveled at the grandeur of the Palace of Versailles. We've stood in awe of the Notre Dame Cathedral, gazed at the city from the heights of the Eiffel Tower, and immersed ourselves in the vibrant culture of the Latin Quarter. The Sacre Coeur Basilica has offered us spiritual tranquility, while the catacombs have whispered tales from the depths of history. Each location has offered not just sights to see but also activities to engage in, from boat cruising to art viewing, to exploring the city's rich history and culture. In the end, Paris is not just a city, but an experience, a journey into the heart of France. So, when are you booking your trip to Paris?